What's good, y'all? Welcome back to another video. I know what you're thinking. Andrew, where you been at? My bad, y'all, man. I just, I've been working, man. I got a regular job. <laughs> I sound depressed, but no, I'm not depressed. But yeah, I got a regular job. And it's been taking up most of my time, so. Yeah. I know that you're probably saying, you got a regular job. I thought you were doing YouTube. And, I mean, I am, but it's like, man, you, YouTube takes time. You know, YouTube takes time. Like, this is not, you hop on and then it's soon, you making millions, you know? This is, it's not that, bro. You really got to work, bro. You really have to work. Anyways, but yeah, that's why I've been gone. But what better time? The comeback is during the playoffs. Now, I watched that Laker and Minnesota game and what was the, the Miami Hawks game. Miami is trash. I'm sorry. <laughs> Miami is trash. I'm not going to lie to you. Like how y'all got Kyle Lowry carrying y'all. Like Kyle Lowry should not be carrying y'all. Like, like Miami is not good on this year. Like hopefully playoff Jimmy Butler comes out. Or something, I don't know. And what happened to Bam Adebayo? Bam Adebayo does not seem like he's the same player anymore. I don't know what's going on with him. But. And then now to the Laker game. Um, I know the Lakers won. But like, I don't, I don't feel good about that win. I know what you're probably. Another thing. I know what you're saying. You're still supporting the Lakers. It's a 50-50 with the Lakers. Like, I'm not a Lakers fan. I don't like a, the Lakers as an organization. I No, I don't like the Lakers. But I love LeBron. <laughs> I love LeBron. Like it's, I I can't hate LeBron. I can't hate. I can't hate LeBron at all. Like it's, I can't do it. I know I'm a I'm a diehard Russ fan. I am, but like LeBron is my goat. I can't hate him. But back to what I was saying. I don't. That did not look like a good win. Like I'm happy they won. I'm happy they got into the playoffs. But it went to OT. And Minnesota didn't even have their two best defenders. Anthony Edwards shot, what, three for like 20? And it still went to OT. That's not good, in my opinion. Meanwhile, LeBron and AD are fighting for their lives. LeBron looking exhausted. Doing all this just to get into the playoffs, you know? In the play-in, LeBron got to carry... In the playing tournament, like that's not good. It's not good at all. Like it's like I know Laker fans are happy to be in the playoffs. I know y'all look at that as a good good thing, but like LeBron having to do all that to get into the playoffs is not good. I feel like he's getting tired. He's gonna be tired, you know. But I could be wrong because it's LeBron. LeBron has pulled off the unbelievable. Like, I don't get this man. He's not human. So I hope I'm wrong. Like, that man is 38. He shouldn't be having to carry like this no more. Like, it's absolutely ridiculous. But, yeah, I'm glad they made it, at least. But they're playing against Memphis, a young team, and I don't like Memphis at all. Oh, my gosh. The whole thing with Dylan Brooks talking like he's a five-time championship, five-time all-star, and scores like 25 a game. Like, bro, he talks so much like he's, like, a superstar, and I don't like that. And then the whole thing with John Morant, like, that's corny in itself. Like, come on, man. Overall, Memphis is just corny as ever. They're, like, overall just corny. So I really hope the Lakers win that series. <laughs> I really do. And the Hawks are playing Boston. 4-0 sweep. <laughs> Boston is sweeping them boys. <laughs> Big sweep, like get your brooms. Big sweep. Well, let's talk about Golden State and Sacramento. Now, that might be a fun series because Sacramento hasn't been in the playoffs in like decades. Um, when, when was the last time they made it? It was like 2000, right? It was 2000 something, right? I know it was early 2000s. <laughs> like, that was the last time I was like a baby. So that was the last time they made the playoffs. So that might that might be cool because you know their home arena might be rocking. Like their home arena is gonna be so loud, and I'm gonna be there for it. I love it. I'm gonna love it. 
And but like I don't I don't think they're gonna be Golden State though. Golden State has playoff experience. Nobody on the Kings really has playoff experience besides what Harrison Barnes. <laughs> Harrison Barnes is like their most experienced player, I think. Other than that, I don't I don't see anybody else with really any experience and like I, yeah, I just I just don't see anybody else with any experience. And I feel like Golden State is gonna take advantage of that and beat them in maybe like six games, maybe. Um Clippers and Phoenix. Oh my gosh, bro. Like the Clippers are dumb, bro. Like I understand y'all wanna act y'all wanna act like y'all have no fear and play the Phoenix in the first round. But like, bro, I did not want to play Phoenix in the first round, bro. I didn't, bro. I'm going to be honest, bro. I got Phoenix going all the way to the finals and winning the finals. Because, I mean, Katie, Chris Paul, Devin Booker, DeAndre Ayton. Like, come on. Like, that's a finals team. That's a championship in itself. Like, just off of them names. But, um, I don't know. I really did not want the Clippers to play Phoenix in the first round. But, of course, the Clippers... Of course, Tyron Lue is like, oh, no, we're not running from the smoke and all that. But, I mean, I love it. But, like, bro, I did not want to play them first round, bro. Maybe second round. Like, I'd rather play Kings or Memphis. Oh, no. Maybe even Denver. Not the, not the Suns, though. But, yeah, I got, I got Phoenix in maybe six games, maybe. I really hope I'm wrong. I really hope I'm wrong. I really want the Clippers to win. Oh my gosh. Because if the Clippers beat the Suns, that means they can beat anybody. It don't matter who it is. Don't matter who it is if they beat the Suns. But, um, and now the Denver and who versus either OKC or Pelicans, it don't matter because Denver's going to win it anyway. It don't matter. If that, that, that series doesn't matter. Denver's going to win it. Maybe a sweep, maybe. May or in five games, one of those. Um, now to the East. I feel like I, I feel like Boston or Milwaukee are going to the finals. Maybe Milwaukee. That's who I. That's my pick. But either Milwaukee or Boston. Like they're so far better than everybody else. It's not even funny. Like especially Milwaukee. Milwaukee is so much better than everybody in the East. It's kind of crazy. Like they're a good team with Giannis. They're they're no, they're a great team with Giannis, and they're a good team without Giannis. Like that's kind of crazy to think about. Like, and I don't even has Middleton even been playing, and that is good still. Like they don't even got that second best player on the on the team playing right now, right? I don't I don't even remember last time I seen Middleton even playing. But yeah, I I feel like Milwaukee is gonna blow through the East. I'm not gonna lie, unless they play like Boston. But yeah, I feel like they're gonna blow through the East. Like whoever they play, either Toronto or Chicago, don't matter. I mean, I said Toronto. It it don't matter who they play in this playing tournament. They don't. It don't matter who they play. It doesn't matter who they play at all. But um, and it, same thing with Denver. It don't matter who they play in this playing tournament. Doesn't matter. Um. But yeah, I got Milwaukee going to the finals. And now let's talk about Cleveland and New York. Um, that could go either way for real. Like, I don't know. I don't know, man. I got Cleveland maybe pulling that out because I feel like they got the better team. Like, they got their guard play is real tough. Garland and Donovan Mitchell. Donovan Mitchell has been playing like a freaking superstar this year. Like, oh my God. Like, he's been crazy. Um, J same thing with Jalen Brunson. Jalen Brunson has been going crazy as well. But I don't know. I feel like Cleveland got the better team, especially with them twin towers they got in the paint. Jared Allen and Evan Mobley. Is Jared Allen injured? I don't know. He might be. I'm. I could be wrong though. I remember. I remember last time I heard about him, he was hurt. But I could be wrong though. I don't know if he's hurt still. But yeah, if they have him. And Evan Mobley and Darius Garland and uh, Donovan Mitchell. I don't see I I don't see many teams beating that. You know that's a really tough team. 
and you could really start anybody at the three position on the, on that team because, like, like I said, the guard play and then your the twin towers is kind of that's kind of tough. So I got Cleveland pulling that out. Philly versus Brooklyn. Now this would be a great series if um Ben Simmons was playing, but of course he's not because he's I don't know what is he hurt? He got back problems still or something? I guess I don't know. But I don't know what's going on with dude. Like, I really, I'm not going to lie. I really used to be a fan of bro. Like, I was one of those people calling him the next LeBron when he was in Philly. I was, I was one of those people calling him the next LeBron. Like, he was looking like the next LeBron. Like, he was able to, this, this dude is 6'10". Great build. Strong. Fast. Quick. And pass. And jump high. Like, he can defend. Like, the only thing he couldn't do was shoot the ball. That was the only thing. And I was just like, oh, that's going to come with time, you know? He's going to develop his jumper. Like, you know, kind of how, like, like, Giannis has developed his jumper. But, of course not. That's not what happened. I don't know what's happened with him, bro. His bro's mental is, like... I don't know. Like, I don't even know if he wants to even play basketball anymore, which I mean, I can't really blame him now at this point. Cause like, it's really looking like really bad for him. It's looking really bad for him. Like, I don't, I don't see how he comes back from this, you know? Cause like he had the perfect team around him and it didn't work out. Like he had Katie and Kyrie and he wasn't even playing with them. So like, I don't, I don't know, bro. I, I don't know. But I got Philly and maybe six games, maybe. I feel like uh, Bridges will win Brooklyn a few games. So I got Philly and six. But, hey, I'm going to let this be known right now, bro. If if Philly lo- somehow loses that series, that's going to – and beat and Harden are going to look so bad, bro. So bad. Because, like, they always, like, collapse in the playoffs, especially James Harden, bro. He always collapsed in the playoffs. And that's really bad, dog. Like, that's the only thing I'll be saying about bro. bro. Bro is one of the best players I've ever seen play. Can't even lie. But, like, he always collapsing in the playoffs. And that's not good. But, yeah, I got Philly in six. Maybe five. But he, overall, I got Philly winning the series. And did I already talk about Boston? I think I already talked about Boston. Whoever they play, it don't matter. 4 0 sweep. Don't matter who it is. Unless it's Miami. I don't know what it is. Miami is like their, I don't know, their kryptonite, even though they beat them last year. I feel like Miami might give them a few games, might beat them a few games. I don't know. But either way, I still see Boston winning their first round matchup. Doesn't matter. And, but yeah, those are my predictions for the, the playoffs. Man, bro, I really did not want the Clippers to play the back to the back to my team, the Clippers. My team is the Clippers cuz you know I'm a, a Russell Westbrook fan. Um Dang, man, I did not want to play the Clippers in the first round, bro. Like, bro, what was they doing, bro? They just couldn't lose that last game, huh, bro? They just couldn't lose, bro. I don't care, bro. I I did not want to play the Suns in the first first round, bro. I'm like, oh my gosh, especially with Al PG, bro. We don't even, I don't even think, I don't know if PG is going to come back for the first round. He might be out. I'll, I'll be happy if he does. That would be great. But, oh man, bro. I, I, I will say this. I do have a little bit of hope because the Clippers do have a lot of depth on their team. They have a great bench player. So I can, I'm not really like, I'm not saying this is going to be a sweep or nothing. Like, the Clippers, I feel like the Clippers are definitely going to put up a fight. But do I think they're going to beat the Suns? Nah, not really, bro. Like, I really don't. Like, KD and freaking Devin Booker and then uh, CP3. Like, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I really don't see them beating that. I'll be shocked if they do, if they do end up beating that. That would be kind of crazy. I will be happy. I would be. Uh, I would be in my next video talking, about, acting like we won the chip, boy. I'll be. I'll be in. I'll be in the, I'll be in the uh, next video talking crazy if the Clippers beat the Suns in the um 
first round. Because if the Clippers beat the Suns in the first round, the Clippers can beat anybody then. It don't matter who it is. The Clippers would be able to beat anybody if if they beat the Suns. Oh my gosh, bro. I really I'm I'm really so sick, bro. I really did not want to play the Suns, bro. Katie really went to the Suns, bro. Such a whole move, bro. That is such a whole move, bro. That nigga really went to the Suns, bro. Like, oh my gosh, like Bro, it is. I'm not gonna lie. It is really like I love. I have a love hate relationship with KD. You know, like I really, I really like. Bro, he's one of the greatest that I've ever seen. He's one of the reasons why I really like basketball. Cause I really, I really, he, I really like that OKC team back in the day. You know, from like 2012 to like, I say from 2012 from like 2011 to. When did, when did he leave? Like 2017? When he left? I really loved him in OKC. Like OKC, him, Harden, and Russ on that OKC team, that they really made me fall in love with basketball watching it. That was like the first team I ever liked. And then he up and left, went to Golden State. And then from that point on, it was like, I can't really like bro, you know? I was real, I was cool with him in Brooklyn because it was like you know he was a star player on Brooklyn he wasn't that wasn't really a star a uh, super team Brooklyn wasn't Brooklyn wasn't no super team until James Harden went there <laughs> that's when I was just like okay I can't I can't like him now then he decides to go to the Suns you know uh, another another super team but like bro, like it's like bro come on bro like come on man like why can't you drive the boat bro. <laughs> Cause like I said, I got the I got uh the Suns going to the finals and winning. Like I got them beating everybody. Like, like I don't really see anybody stopping Devin Booker, KD, and Chris Paul. Like I don't I don't see that happening. I can't believe he went to the Suns, dog. Oh my gosh, that makes me so mad, bro. But hopefully they somebody somebody beats them. Hopefully, I hope it would be the Clippers. That would be great. But I don't see it happening. I see the I see the Suns going all the way and winning the championship. But that's just me. But that's gonna do it for this video. Be but oh oh before I go, before y'all say um, I am gonna still be gaming. I'm still gonna be doing gaming videos. I'm still gonna be doing all that. I know I still have God of War to finish and Horizon. I've been uh there's a whole bunch of games that ha have coming out came out like um Hogwarts has come out I gotta play that I gotta play that it's look it's so fun I'm not gonna lie I gotta put that on YouTube uh Horizon the second game I gotta play that since you know I played the first one but yeah I'm still gonna be gaming I still got Horizon and got a world to finish so expect those in the future I'm back you know I'm back to my YouTube, my favorite thing ever to do. But yeah, expect more reactions and especially to the playoffs. Yeah, that's going to do it to the, for this video then. Make sure to like, subscribe, comment. Peace.